Hi, my name is John, and in this video I will show you how to use the scroll trigger animations in Fancy Animations 2.4.3. With this new version, we now have a graphical interface that makes the animations much easier to use. Ok, select one element, for example the image, uh, style, and go, I'll go to the scroll trigger animations, add the animations, you can find the animations, in this case, for example, I will add right to left and then uh, apply the animations. This reload is required because of how Bricks handles Ajax calls in the editor. Ok, uh, enable the fancy animation button and now you can see that this works. This is the animations right to left, start at the 0% of the screen and end up the 100% of the screen. Ok, select the element, style, scroll trigger animations and now I will change the percent of the screen that the animation start and end. I will set that the animation start at the 20%, ok, this is start at the 20%. Um, some elements render the animations without reload but is uh, always a good idea to click on the button to ensure the animations save. Ok, other animations um, don't uh, work, they need reload because uh, this is the way to Bricks Builder works. Ok, Thomas uh, say me that this required uh, more Ajax calls and they are working on um, better performance in the editor. Ok, in, in this moment this is the way to Bricks Builder works. Uh, ok, select the uh, image, uh, start at the one and the twenty percent. Okay, you can see that this. Uh, okay, now in the twenty percent start, and I will set that end at the uh, sixty percent. Okay, to show all the image. Okay, twenty uh, percent, and you can see that this end at the sixty percent. Ok, take in account that the percent depend of the screen and the size of the elements, ok? The, this depend of the boot screen and uh, element size. Ok, and now I will set, uh, for example, I will set uh, zoom, I will change this for zoom. Ok, you can see that uh, don't work, is uh, very 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 important, apply animation boot. Okay, I will enable the fancy animation and you can see that now this works but I need set that the image start okay and uh, from the for example 20 person and this is the 20 person of the zoom you can see and the zoom is uh, 0 to 1 because in this case uh, 20 person is 0 uh, 0.2 and you can see, ok, I will set for example uh, 50% now you can see that this is a 50% and end, ok, at 60% I will set for example um, end at the 80% now you can see that this end of the animation ok, for example, now you can see 100% now you control the start end uh, of the screen percentage and you can uh, control the animation start uh, from and to. Uh, you can invert the animation for example uh, you can see that this start of the 100% and end at the 50% you can see that this works ok this is all for the uh, the options of the animations, you can add more animation, for example uh, I will set um, fade, I can use a uh, rotate and zoom because the uh, zoom and rotate use a uh, transform with the custom animations we can combine different transforms but uh, we will cover this in the future videos now you can see that this works, ok, fade Okay, and you can set the start end from to 
of the fade animation too. Okay, I will delete this. Uh, we also have uh, inverted animation and uh, disable on mobile, disable on tablet. For example, if I disable this on tablet, okay, you can see that the animation don't work. This don't work on mobile. This don't work on portrait. And for example, I will set a uh, disable for mobile. Okay, this works on table and tablet. And now this disable the animation on mobile. This is very very uh, useful for advanced animations. And then for options like um, I am parent, game parent. This is for advanced animations. And these options uh, will cover it in the future videos. And this is all. This is the update for fancy animations. And I will, I hope this update help you to make animations much easier. Um, in the future updates, I will add gradually uh, other options like um, entry animations, uh, text animations, um, mouse animations like the scroll trigger animations but for the moment the scroll trigger animations are the more advanced animations for the fancy animations and i am working on the other animations to make this easy to use okay this is all hope this video helped you and see you in the next videos bye